Hi, in this video we're going to talk about when is the right time to upgrade your Wi-Fi router. We all know that a fast and reliable internet connection is essential for everything, from streaming your favorite show to working from home and staying connected with friends and family. But how do we know when it's the right time to invest in a new router? Of course the manufacturers might always encourage you to upgrade because that's how they earn money, but if you're like me who don't want to spend money on something on necessary then this video is for you we're gonna explore four key signs that indicate it might be right time for an upgrade so let's begin number one if you have a wi-fi router that has reached its end of life it means first of all it is very old so the wi-fi technology is also outdated this might not necessarily be an issue for some people as it could still meet their needs however it also means the manufacturers have stopped providing updates for that router which includes important security patches using an end-of-life router puts your network at risk of cyber attacks Upgrading to a new model not only gives you access to new features and improved technology, but also ensures you have the latest security protections. If you have an end-of-life router, don't wait for problems to arise. Stay ahead by keeping your hardware up to date. Number 2. Consider upgrading your router if your internet speed is faster than what your current Wi-Fi technology can handle. Many older routers use outdated standards which may not fully utilize the high-speed internet plans available today. For instance, if you have a gigabit internet plan but your router maxes out at 600 megabits per second, you're not getting the full benefit of what you're paying for. Keep in mind that 600 megabits per second is actually shared among all all the devices connected to Wi-Fi because Wi-Fi is a shared medium. Upgrading to a modern Wi-Fi router can unlock faster speeds, reduce latency, and better performance, ensuring that every device in your network gets the most out of your high-speed internet connection. Now, that was only for the Wi-Fi connection. As far as the wired network is concerned, it is important that the ports on the Wi-Fi router are capable of handling your internet speed too. For example, if you have a 2 gigabits per second internet plan, but your router's WAN port is only 1 gigabits per second, you're not using half of your internet bandwidth. Usually, if you check the Wi-Fi router's website or data sheet, it should tell you the maximum internet speed this particular router is designed for. Considering everything, the Wi-Fi, the ports, the processing power, the whole package, sometimes a router is capable of handling the internet speed, but as soon as you enable some security features such as intrusion prevention system, the speed drops significantly, so the whole package should be able to handle your internet speed. For example, this ASUS RTAX86U Pro, which we discuss on this channel frequently, is designed for internet speeds up to 2 gigabits per second. Number 3. Another sign it is time to upgrade is when your devices are more advanced than your Wi-Fi router. Modern gadgets like smartphones, laptops, smart TVs, and gaming consoles are built to work with the latest Wi-Fi standards for the best performance. If your router is outdated, it won't be able to keep up, leading to slower speeds and poor connectivity. For example, if you have a high-end smartphone or laptop that supports Wi-Fi 7, but your router is still Wi-Fi 5, you're not getting the best experience. Upgrading your router makes sure those devices can perform at their best. It is usually best to have a router with Wi-Fi technology that is at least as good as, if not better than your devices. Number four, which is the last one, but definitely not least, is about upgrading your Wi-Fi router when you're dealing with some persistent issues. For example, if you're constantly facing disconnections, slow internet speeds, or dead zones in your home, it might be time for an upgrade. Might be. Because newer Wi-Fi generations usually bring better speed, capacity, range, and overall efficiency. They do that by using newer frequency bands, improved antennas, and other 
technology upgrades. I emphasize that it might be time to upgrade because some troubleshooting must be done first. If the verdict is that better Wi-Fi technology could solve those problems, then it's probably a good time to upgrade. For example, imagine you're using Wi-Fi 6, but your connection and speed are still terrible on both frequencies. You start troubleshooting by checking the Wi-Fi channel situations in your area. Typically, you would do that by using a Wi-Fi analyzer, something we talked about in that video in case you're not familiar with it. If, for example, you discover there's interference on both bands pretty much on every channel, then you know that those bands are unfortunately hopeless in your area. This happens if you live in a crowded environment. In this case, upgrading to a Wi-Fi 6E or Wi-Fi 7, which have a 6 GHz band that is less crowded and has more channels compared to the other two, might just fix your Wi-Fi issues once and for all. You had a problem, you investigated and realized upgrading the router is the solution. But sometimes the issue isn't with the router. Maybe your laptop has outdated driver software for its Wi-Fi card, causing connection issues that have nothing to do with your router. In this case, updating the laptop's drivers is the fix, not a new router. The key is to troubleshoot and identify the real problem first. If the issue is due to an old Wi-Fi technology, then it's a good time to upgrade. If it is something else, upgrading the router might not solve it. Alright, that was it and I hope you liked the video. If you do your research and realize you need to upgrade, then definitely check out the video description where I have listed the top Wi-Fi routers you can buy in 2024. If you follow the channel, then you probably know that recently and in previous videos, I've been talking about the top Wi-Fi routers on the market. I'm gonna link those videos as well as the wireless routers in the video description. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you liked it. Give it a thumbs up if you did share it if you think others might like it too and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos like this thank you again and i will see you next time